Hello everybody, my name is Aaron, aka Point Eighth, and welcome back to Tomb Raider 2. Uh, currently on the remastered version of said Tomb Raider 2. Remind me what this does. Anyway, the last... I was going to record some more of the unfinished business, but... Ooh, the last, uh... The last episode of this came out, like, yesterday. Oh shit. Maybe shouldn't have done that. I might have just soft locked myself. Well, not soft locked myself. I might have just trapped myself. But anyway, yeah. The last episode of this came out like yesterday. And, uh, since I've been very stuck on what to do, somebody mentioned. I say somebody. The guy who's been commenting on every one of my Tomb Raider videos, I see you. Shouts out. And thank you for all the help. <laughs> Seriously. I um, mentioned that around this sort of point, I was on the right track. While I was around here somewhere. So, I'm... Curious how this is going to go. I might have already skipped past a bit of me being on the right track. That is also a very real possibility. <laughs> I mentioned it while I was in the water. Oh, bollocks. Alright, try again. Oops a daisy. It's so dark. Bollocks. I do feel like that's going to end up being my catchphrase throughout most of Tomb Raider. Specifically Tomb Raider 2. It's going to be, oh bollocks. Alright. I damn well want to get out of this sodding opera house today. One way or another. We are getting out of this sodding opera house today. All right. Okie dokie. Ah, there's also a, a point that uh, was made in the said comment as well that said being high up here in the Opera House, it's worth doing a side-by-side -side comparison of this and the new graphics. Ooh, that's a fancy chandelier. Nice fancy chandelier. No fancy chandelier. Fancy chandelier. No fancy chandelier. Fancy chandelier. Huh. What's over there? There is another platform above. I have an idea. I'm not sure if this is uh, going to work or if this is even intended. But I have an idea. Oh, balls. Oh no, it's fine. I just need to remember how to get back on the top platform. I've used so many flares. So many flares. That is still open, isn't it? Yes. Okay. Right. Mm, not for the boulders. Run. Okay. I'm going for a oh, wobbly camera. Wobbly camera. And let me up. Let me up. Let me at him. Let me at him. And then I could get in through here, couldn't I? If I press the button. 
Push the button. No. Come on. Now? Alright then. Uh, what about you? You're going to close this? You are? What about you? Well, that gave me a, the jingle. It's usually a good start. No. Oh, all right. Screw you too, Lara. Well, I guess I'm going back this way. I seem to have no other options. How do you get back in there then? It's so dark. I can't wait for a level that's actually got some sodded light in it. <laughs> right. There's got to be a way to get back up there and I can't remember what it is. Is it all going this way? Because it doesn't involve going that way. Oh. Uh. Yeah, that's too high of a drop. Oh, that was close. I don't know if you can hear the cogs turning in my head. Because I definitely can. So many flares. This, this opera house is going to just be littered with the flares that I've just thrown everywhere. <laughs> Being lost running in circles trying to work out what the bloody hell I'm meant to do. I do have an idea, but I have no idea how to actually execute said idea. So I feel I have to get up to there. And it looks like that might be doable. I've done all this bit. Yeah, I've done all that. However... Feel like there's an option that I've missed. Oh, you get all there by that side, don't you? Right. Sorry, I'm somewhat talking to myself. Actually, all of my videos are talking to myself. What am I talking about? Okay, yeah, I've got to do it from the higher up. We're fine. We're fine. Just a casual save because these things are pains in the ass, or more like pains in the head and face and everything else. Oh god! This is why we save! Because gravity hates me. Ah. 
Whoa, okay. That one took so much health off me the first time, it took nothing. And I felt it hit me, because my controller vibrated. See, in that time it let me go. And didn't kill me. Very nearly did, but... Which I can do this this time. Surely I can reach that. We're trying it. We're trying it. There's got to be a way to reach it. There's got to be. Maybe going backwards. Could you get a bit more? Nope. Okay. Not gonna happen. Got it. I have been down here, because I'm sure I picked something up down here. I haven't just gone full circle for nothing, have I? There's got to be something else down here to grab. It has to be something I've missed. There just has to be. Hold that. I'm going back. I'm going to try something. Don't think I'll reach that, but we'll try. the big question of how the hell right, how the hell do I get back up there I need to open that again That's the big thing, is I need something to open that with. I'm sure I was up there at some point. What am I forgetting? Really? Oh! I had no idea I had that out! Okay then. There's a whole extra room that just uh -huh. opens when you get close to it. Duly noted. Oh, bollocks. <laughs> Where am I loading from? Ah, oh, damn it. Oh, I've done the dumb thing again, haven't I?
automatic pistols. Uzis. Yeah, I did uh, get it pointed out that I have the Uzis now. I thought I just got a lot of Uzi ammo. I didn't realise I actually had the Uzis. Right. Open. Sweet. Uh huh. Right, now we save. So I don't get bombarded again. Give me flares. How? Just how? Someone explain this to me. Well, they haven't rolled from a flat surface, at least. But there's nothing here. I thought I'd made progress. I've just made a mess. Really? This was a hidden side area that was purely just there to try and kill you? There was nothing else here. Nothing here but death. Well, that sucks. Here I was thinking I'd made some level of progress. Serves me right. Hmm. You know what, you guys are just going to watch me run around in circles for a while, so I'll be back in a moment or two once I find out something that I need to do. So... I fell in the uh, elevator shaft again, uh -huh. and I just found this. <laughs> Don't ask me how, I am not sure. I came across it sort of by accident. I was literally just roaming around the level like, what am I missing? and somehow fell back down the elevator shaft and stumbled across this little side passage that I completely missed. That explains the comment! Ah, oh, that I was around here and he was like, you were on the right track at this point. That explains it. Uh, it makes sense now. See, everything comes together in the end. Alright. Okie dokie. Art's jokey. Pitch black again. This game spared no expense on the darkness, did it? It does believe in a thing called love. Which just so happens to only be a feeling. That's growing on me. I'll start with the darkness references now. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> At least for the time being. And I'm assuming... That massive giant circuit board thing that I found goes here. Yes, it does. Bit of up. The hell did that do? Whatever it did, I'm saving. Because that feels like it was important. Why can I not get through here? Do you do anything? You're doing something because I can hear it. I 
I just don't know what. Is there an opening there before? Oh, the stage is different! It's lifted the curtain on the stage! Ah! Die. I'm very much assuming that when I go through that, I'm going to need full health. The hell? I thought Lara was just walking on water for a second. No, she's good. Didn't know she was that good. I want to assume the exit is behind the stage. Thought there was somebody there. Uh huh. Shotgun shells. Uh, it's better than nothing, I guess. All right. Before I go in, wish me luck. <laughs> oh! Alright, three dudes down. Uh -huh. I had a feeling that I was going to get jumped the second I got back here. Alright. Still not convinced I'm on my own in this maze of boxes. Well, that's back on the stage again, so I don't need to be there. Alright. Are any of these boxes movable? They look a bit tall. Didn't go this way before. That looks movable. It is. Okay. <laughs> Onto something. <laughs> Alright. Ooh, a little hidden compartment. Okay, you don't have a little, like, Gremlin hiding in here. What did that do? Sounds like it opened something. Probably means it let in more people trying to kill me. Shockingly, no. Oh, it's just a brick. I was looking there, I was like, that texture looks weird on the floor. Still so dark. Ow. Alright, well, I've pulled a switch. I have no idea what this switch does. And I am none the wiser about what I'm doing or where I'm going. I thought there'd be an exit back here. Oh, hello. Oh. Never mind. Wait, is there something on the ground? No. What the hell did that do, then?
Did that, did that lower the curtain? Do we have to go back up here? Here I was, thinking the exit was back there. The exit's here. I just nearly fell. <laughs> I'm assuming that's the exit. That's pitch black down there. That didn't help me at all. Shit. Help me, I'm stuck in a hole. Really? So the exit to the level was here the whole time. Ow! Well that sucks. Why do I get the feeling that there's going to be a lot of dudes that are going to try and kill me the second I go down here? Who the hell are you? What's with the weird, like, kinky masquerade mask thing? Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Did that dog just try and eat my shoe? There's got to be a reason for this, right? And then give me a flare. Was it really nothing? Was it really just to try and kill me? It was just to try and kill me, wasn't it? Or was it just to get, like, an easy way? Yeah, it's probably just an easy way to get to this section. In case you feel like you missed anything and had to go back. That was probably what it was. Probably just the developers being nice for a change. Alright. Well... Dude does a lot of damage, and I have, like, no health. Right, I'll open this. But I'm not going to go down there and kill him, because there's no need. Okay, I got through that with more health. I also, now I have the Uzis, I'm going to get them out. Because I feel like they're needed. Just keep jumping. Health needed.
Is he dead? Nope. Now he's dead. I think. Sweet. Grenades. Definitely now saving, because my god. Oh, why more dudes? Uh -huh. Why does it give me a health kit at the exact moment where I'm just going to need to use it? I'm guessing that's the exit. Oh. The exit's closed. Alright. Gotta be a button in here somewhere. I'm guessing... It's gotta be hidden in that corner, right? Video game logic, it's got to be hidden in that corner, so there's got to be a way up somewhere. Let me get some light on the situation again. Alright, nothing here. So where's the way up? One of these pull out? No. That corner. No. Ah, there. Okay, just keep it steady. Nice and steady. Oh, they don't like there's anything there. Have I got it wrong? Maybe I've got it wrong. Oh no, there is a button there. I can see it. Bit of boop. There we go. Knew it. Get the hell out of here. Get me the hell out of this sodding opera house. Oh, hello, hello. Got a plane. Can't stop. Got a plane to catch. Ow. I bumped my head off. But still, we got a plane to catch. Thank God for that. Oh, we can't just switch between them in the cutscenes. Nice. Goth Lara. Clumsy as shit. <laughs> Sky. Pitch black. Sky. Pitch black. <laughs> So this has got to be Marco, right? 
This has got to be the guy who we're after. Yes, it's Marco. Okay. Marco Bartoli. Why did he Oh, God. Steven Seagal. <laughs> okay. Steven Seagal took us down. But, ladies and gentlemen, that finally is going to do it for that episode. So thank you everybody so much for watching. Thank you so much for joining me in this one. It has been a genuine pleasure as per usual. Like, comment, subscribe. You know the drill. All the fun stuff. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye.